But we began on Southwest Military, where police say two men are now dead after an attempted robbery, and the shooter is claiming self-defense. The alleged robbery happened at the Chase Bank at I-35 and Southwest Military. Ken's 5 reporter Andrew Moore tells us what police believe happened so far. Andrew? Yeah, right now police are saying it was actually the robbery victim who shot the two people who were trying to rob him. Though they also say that's only based on preliminary information. An individual drove up to the ATM. He saw it. An individual coming toward him. It all happened at this drive through bank on the southwest side. A man drove up to the ATM and then saw another person approaching by foot and a second person in a car. Police say the man believed he was being robbed and decided to shoot. He pulls a handgun, shoots both of them, both of them are deceased in the parking lot. So that's what we know right now. And that was all police were able to say. Chief William McManus wasn't able to tell us exactly what the man who shot these robbers said. And we still don't know if those robbers were armed. We're still looking at that. Police also say there were two sedans involved, one of which was still at the crime scene. Police said they are still interviewing the victim. Uh, we are interviewing the, the person they attempted to rob right now. Police say all three people are believed to be in their 20s. The chief also said that this could have been the robbers using a jugging strategy. That's when they wait for someone to withdraw money at an ATM and then follow them to another location. Live at Public Safety Headquarters, Andrew Moore, KINS 5. All right, Andrew.